Oh, bored. Hey, frat release. It is just Maddie in this video. Today, I am going to be doing my first ever house tour. I don't think I've ever done like an official house tour. I know I've done a room tour, but I've never really showed y'all my whole house. <laughs> and I think that's kind of weird because y'all know like everything about my life, but I've never done a house tour. So we are starting this video just sitting on my floor because my camera that I'm using for this video is huge. Like it literally weighs like 10 pounds. I actually want to put it on the scale to see how much it weighs because the lens is huge, the camera is huge. It's an EOS 80D with a 1635 lens. I don't know what the term is, but it's it has like really good face tracking and stuff. So, um <laughs> It's very heavy. <laughs> so let's hope I don't drop my camera. But I figured today I would do a house tour. I just want to show y'all where I live and <laughs> not where I live. Like I'm not giving my address. But I just want y'all to like know more about where I live. Not my address, but just like the environment I live in. So obviously this is my room. We'll get to this later though. We will start downstairs and I will give y'all the full rundown of my house. <laughs> And this is a very realistic house tour. It's not going to be perfectly clean. Like, this is a kid house. <laughs> like, there are six children living here. And I'm one of them. Am I a child? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I have four siblings and then Everly. So maybe five children. I don't know. I feel like I still count as a child because I make messes too. <laughs> but, um, yeah, this is a kid house. So we have a clutter. We have toys everywhere. We have drawing on drawings on the wall. We have freaking stains on our ceiling from sticky toys being stuck to it. Like, this is going to be real and raw. <laughs> so I'm going to start out by going downstairs and showing y'all everything. <laughs> Except for the garage. We don't, we don't talk about the garage. We never talk about the garage. Okay, this is my front door. We just have a cute little yard right here. It's the front yard. Um, Texas heat killed it. <laughs> We have a little bush, and then when you walk in, there's a little bicycle and just a cute little front porch with a little garden and some chairs and a very, very worn table. Like, I don't know what happened there. And then we go in. Right here, we have our little doorbell and a spooky, scary pumpkin because spooky season starts early in this house. So, go in. Immediately, we have the staircase. And when we turn this way, there's a little, this is supposed to be the formal dining room, but it's more of like a playroom. This is a little setup like right next to our front door. There is a family picture right there from me and my siblings when we were young. Our security system, a security camera, a little quote. I actually got that from my mom. And these are just straight up junk drawers. Like they're full of crap. Like watch this, they're, it's so bad. <laughs> it's just mail. <laughs> so in here we have Everly's little princess chair, a little car, and two gymnastics mats. And then this is just a shelf with tons of toys. Literally, there are so many hand-me-down toys. Like, this is just full of toys. And then we have our shoe box right here, filled with shoes. Some have a pair, some do not. <laughs> and then we walk into the kitchen. This is our fridge. It just has like, Lots of pictures on it. It's a very family fridge. Not a wife fridge though. <laughs> Got me an Ev. And then Everly's first day at gymnastics. And open it up. It's too small for our family. Like, <laughs> it's just not big enough. Then right here we have the pantry. Once again, just filled with crap. We have like our little bread thing. Toaster. Two coffee makers, this is my parents' coffee maker, and this is mine. Got our little dishwasher, sink, <laughs> flowers, and spooky, spooky decorations. And there's our stove and microwaves. This microwave is just for decoration. It doesn't work. This is our actual microwave. We've lived in this house for like seven years now and everything's just breaking. Like nothing works anymore, so. We've had our dishwasher stop, stop working and our microwave stop working. So that's fun. And this is our dining room table. It's just, it's actually really cute. It's handcrafted out of wood. 
then there's Everly's high chair. And we just have that little decoration and some windows. I love the windows in this house because they just let in so much light. Then right here we have the recliner. And if you go into a house with a recliner and there's a couch next to it, don't sit in the recliner. Sit in the couch because the recliner is like the designated dad chair. That's the chair the dad sits in. It's literally in every house I've ever been to, that's the chair the dad sits in. Every time, but I actually sit in the recliner a lot, so. Sorry, Sam. Then we have Slate's little car table, which is really cute. Then we have fireplace with a TV and this little like display box. Got some seashells, some pictures. That's the book. I'm pretty sure that's the book Sam proposed to my mom with. Yeah, and then we just have tons of stuff in there bunch of toys <laughs> and then our couch so if you ever come to our house sit on the couch not the recliner <laughs> and then just some more decorations oh this picture I was actually pregnant and nobody knew I looked so little but now we spin around my mom's room is downstairs so go into my mom's room it's really nice this is where I edit um, there's a mirror right here, and this is laundry, believe it or not. We just cover it with a blanket so it looks like there's none. There's a window that shows our backyard. Can't really see right now, though. This is Sam's little nightstand. He has sleep apnea, so this is his sleep apnea machine. And they have a TV right there. There was a bigger TV, but Slate broke it, so this is the TV. <laughs> then we've got my mom's nightstand, Slate's high chair, another little display thing some pictures, some little Polaroids. Then this is the bathroom. I spend so much time in this bathroom, I love it so much. There's just tons of crap on the counter, but like, same. This, this is my favorite part of the bathroom. This bathtub. It has jacuzzi jets. And I literally love it so much. When I get my house, like the main thing for me is to have a jacuzzi bathtub. And then there's a shower. It's kind of gross. It gives me claustrophobia. Like, I honestly, I'm, I don't think I've ever taken a shower in there because it just kind of, like, gives me claustrophobia and makes me nervous. I don't know why. But let's head upstairs. More toys. No surprise. And a little fireplace. So, um, as we walk out of my mom's room, it's also a closet under the stairs, which is, like, a little tornado shelter, I guess. Um, but it's just filled with, like, blankets and toys, and we just get in there when there's a tornado. Then walking in the hallway, we have... A bunch of pictures, there's me and Ab, and a cross, and this little long horn thing. Actually, is that a bull? I don't know. And then, there's the laundry room, right there. And then, we have the downstairs bathroom. Okay, so this room is really special, because you are not alone when you're in this room. It's basically haunted by one-year-old Natty. She just watches you while you use the bathroom. She's always watching. Like, she's never not watching. Also, let me see how big my camera is. It's literally huge, and I'm, it's so hard for me to hold them. Like, <laughs> And that, that door leads to the garage, which we don't have. We don't have a garage. We walk up the stairs. We have a little chalkboard board right here. We write stuff on for holidays and stuff. Or AV just writes, like, random stuff, like pee pee poo poo. I don't, I don't know. So we go up the stairs. And this is the upstairs bathroom I share with four of my siblings and Everly. Always smells, never clean, disgusting. <laughs> um, there's Everly's toilet she uses for potty training. And there's just like a little closet right here. It's not much, there's a shower, the bathtub's always gross. Yep, <laughs> it's like stained from hair dye. Then we walk out of the bathroom. There's a hallway right there. I don't know if y'all can see. That is Avi's room and that is Stone's room. We'll see if they'll, they're okay with us showing them. <laughs> and then that is River's room. This is my room. So we've got Everly's toys right here. And then we have some trash because we just got a little makeup set and I put the trash right there to bring it downstairs. It's her little fridge. Just open it and there's food. Then that's her kitchen she got for Christmas. And she has a little unicorn stuffed animals in there, a little chalkboard, and just some storage right there with a printer. And this is her dollhouse she also got for Christmas. Just has a tons of ton of dolls in it. 
and some decorations up there. Then that is my laundry. <laughs> Usually that's like a table that we do crafts at, but I've been doing laundry, so there's just laundry there right now. Then this is Everly's closet. I need a bigger closet for her, or just to get rid of some clothes. So these are all her clothes. There's two rows of them. And then in here we have some diapers, gymnastic suits in there, jewelry in there, sunglasses right there. And then just random like hair stuff in there. This is her shorts drawer. This is her pajama drawer. This is her second pajama drawer. And these are her pants. And then right here we have swimsuits and socks and underwear. So these are Everly's shoes. She has more shoes than me. Like each row has two pairs of shoes like per line. Like she just has way too many shoes. I need to donate some, get rid of some. This is our little window. We've got this little plant from my ex that I haven't thrown away yet for whatever reason. Um, this little plant. I mean, I really use this for counting. It's like a little thingy. A globe for decoration. An Elsa playhouse. Another Elsa playhouse. And these are like all the rocks and shells we've gotten from different places around the world. Like this one's from Venice Beach. This one's from Huntington Beach, Galveston Island, Miramar Beach, um, Santa Monica Pier, Lake Travis, and Barton Springs. And I love them. Oh, you can also see our green pool. Oh, this is a stack of Everly's clothes. This is a stack of my clothes. I need to just put them away. Um, there's my PSL from this morning. This is my coat rack. And we have a ton of books just in these shelves and just storage. Like, we have reusable bags in there. Just all kinds of stuff. Then this is my closet. My room is actually supposed to be a theater room. So I had to build myself a closet. <laughs> so, we've got backpacks right there. Bunch of random crap right there. Blankets right there. Hats right there. Purses right there. Then on that side, we have a bag of laundry. Leggings. Pajama shorts and regular shorts. Sweatpants. And just like books and baby books and stuff. And then that's Everly's special stuff. And then up there, more baby books. More of Everly's stuff. Some jars. Some screws. And a camera box. And a random picture. So that's just like my underwear drawer right there. Then under it, these are my skirts and shorts. It's hard to close. Didn't put it together right. These are my swimsuits and socks. And a tampon. I don't know how that got there. And an Ulta gift card. No, that's a rewards card. Okay. And then those are my pants. Got some shoes right there. Some more shoes right there. And some more shoes right there. <laughs> and some hangers and then we have all my clothes they're organized by color those are my clothes <laughs> then we go this way to my room I have a sliding door I actually painted my room basically by myself Sam helped me but like the top is not that lined up <laughs> so we walk in and right away we have a hanger with like just a bunch of bags and purses like all my thrifted bags this is my only designer bag that's real and then all my fake designer bags actually my Prada bags real but I paid five dollars for it so I don't know if that counts and then just all my stuff hanging there and I have that up there um, Isaac made that for me for Mother's Day and I have my camera bag another camera bag a water purifier because I'm so weird about the water I drink and what is that? Oh, it's a Curology box. <laughs> Use my code for... No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> this has been sponsored. I have some drawings right here. I'm not a very good drawer, but I like to hang up my art. Like, this looks way worse in person. It looks good on camera, but I promise this is horrible in person. This is my old paint pan that I thought was really cute. This is from when I was born. It says, I'm a girl. Um... I guess that's there because I dress like a boy, so if I ever forget, I can remind myself. <laughs> There's a bunch of pictures, and that's just inspiration for while I'm editing of houses I like and like my goals in life. It's kind of like an inspiration board. And then right here, I have a box of like fan mail that I want to hang up. And then I have my journal. I also painted this. 
Once again, it's not very good. Um, I just followed a Bob Ross tutorial. <laughs> and then I have my embroidery stuff. I'm very crafty. I love doing crafts. I have a broken skirt I want to fix. Pencils, paintbrushes, gems. Just random crafty stuff in here. Also random crafty stuff in there. Then when we go under here, we have a basket with like a bunch of random stuff. Then we have a basket under there with paints and that basket just has like random crafty stuff. And that is all clothes I'm like remaking or upcycling. Up here, just have paper, some journals. I wanna read my journals on my channel. I feel like that'd be so funny. Then we have some medicine up there, as well as some jewelry. I just need y'all to prepare yourselves for this part. It's not clean, it's never gonna be clean. I can clean it and it'll be dirty the next hour. My vanity. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's so dirty, I've been trying to organize it, but the top just never stays clean because I do my makeup. But this part's organized, like those are all my foundations. And we've got powders, and these drawers are pretty organized, like got compacts. Palettes. Oh, that's not even coming out. Lord. <laughs> then on this side, we have lashes. So this isn't sponsored, but these are amazing. I've had these on for like four days. They're amazing. That's my mirror that I've had for like seven years. Not seven, probably like four. <laughs> oh, no. Then just a bunch of random crap. That's my booby um, makeup holder. I love it. And then right here, we have a mirror. Just a long ways mirror. And also, this is my favorite part. There's my phone. But this chair, it's like so versatile. You can see like it's not just white. It has so much character to it. It's just a mess. But when you lean this way, it folds over. It's not like broken or anything. Obviously not. Like <laughs> It's just very accessible. So we just kick that back up and crap. I don't let Everly sit in it because she falls out. <laughs> then we've got a little rug right there that's also just not in the right place and then this is where I hang up letters y'all send me I've hung up almost every single one except for the ones over there and then right here we just have filming stuff backdrops tripods my ring light my very ratchet ring light <laughs> and then we have my Xbox remote controllers my trash can and then right here we just have some little some little drawers just miscellaneous stuff in there they're not really like too organized there's my Xbox, my TV, um, some flowers my boyfriend got for Everly, some fake grass. I love this. It says, I still remember when I prayed for the things I have now. And then a salt rock lamp my dad got me. Then another thing I drew like a long time ago. Then that. My TV. And I just got this new little like jewelry hanger. And I really like it. But... This is one of the dressers by my bed. Got my Xbox remotes, a bunch of candles, <laughs> a diffuser, an Amazon Alexa, and no, I'm not talking to you. Go away. So we also have just a little sleep machine. I've got a new candle that I got today. It smells so good. A humidifier, some books, some jewelry, another candle, and my play button. And then we just have a bunch of books. I actually do like reading, so those are my books. Then right here we have all my plane tickets that I've saved. Then just pictures of me and Ev. And right here we have a little coffee table with Everly's little toy on it and a candle. And then a couch, which also has so much character. Like, if you lift it up right here, isn't that beautiful? But we don't talk about that though. This is my bed. This is my favorite part of my room. I love sleeping. So when we go over by my bed, I have this little picture up there. I love it so much. And then we have lights with vines and a hanging light. And then right here, I have more vines. A little quote right there. And then this picture Kaylee gave me for my birthday. And just pictures with all my friends. Like there's me and Cameron. There's me and Slate, there's me and Skylar, me and Everly, me and Everly, me and Everly, me, Cameron, Natalie, Sophie, and Sierra. And then got Everly when she was first born, me and Bella, and then another one of me and Cameron. And this is, these are just like Bible verses that I like. And this is my inspiration board 
for what I want for myself within five years. So I want to travel. I want a big, beautiful house. I want to get closer to God. I want to reach two million on YouTube. I want to go on adventures. I just want to get closer with Everly. I want to turn 18 because I turn 18 in 2021. I want to fall in love, which I have. <laughs> and I don't know. That's just like my goals. So I am going to see if my siblings will let them, me peek in their rooms to show y'all. I really want to show y'all Avi's room because it has the cutest decorations. Like she has records on her walls, like aesthetic pictures. So I want to show y'all that. So let's go ask her. She might be in school. She might be in class right now. Eek. Let's see. She's not even in here. Nice. I'm, I'm just going to show y'all. So Avi's room is so cute. This is a record player. I got her for Christmas. Then she just hangs all her records up here. She made this out of a magazine. That out of a magazine. It says A cab. <laughs> then more records. And this is the um, calendar that counts down to the end of Trump's terms. Also got her that for Christmas. And just a bunch of cute stuff right there. A little hand grab, the same one. And then more things she made out of magazines, which are really cute. More records, a little salt lamp more records bunch of pictures this is her acceptance letter to the biomedical academy this is her bed she has all the aesthetic pictures no record it's just so cute in here and then a tapestry you already know what they say about girls with tapestries stay away and then out that window there's like a ledge on the roof that she climbs out to when she's sad <laughs> i got her this for christmas i think you can probably tell what it says she has a piano you can hear all of that <laughs> and these are clothes I'm selling on my Depop that she's gonna list for me and I'm gonna like pay her for it and yeah that's basically Avi's room the closet is so so cute like look yeah, at that, that. <laughs> whose shirt is that I don't know I found it in your room whose pants are those uh mine because I stole them from you okay say hi to the vlog what if I don't want to then you don't bye okay, bye <laughs> let's go ask stone can I show your room for my video? Okay. Okay, this is Stone. Say hi, Stone. Hello. This is his gaming computer. He has a custom built PC and he loves to game. And then he just has like a bunch of stuff. This is like so cringy. It says I'm too lazy to make friends. Uh, it's literally I, so cringe. I just don't feel like putting it down. At least it's something. That's true. Um, and then that's his tuba. He's in middle school band. That's his band binder, a TV, but an Xbox he hasn't used in years. Just a bunch of Minecraft stuff all over the place. Yeah, and this is a, the, the dirty area. Oh, that's so cute. And then there's an Outstanding Musician Award right right there. Because he's an Outstanding Musician. Oh my god. Yeah, I truly am. You actually are. You're actually better than I was. <laughs> okay. Oh, and then he has a Steve right here. A little crocodile. And yeah, that's Stone's room. Say bye, Stone. Bye. Oh, and then this is his My Boyfriend Obama calendar. <laughs> I got that from for Christmas and he actually hung it up. It says, yes, of course, I'll call you in five minutes. I love you more. No, you hang up first. No, you. Hey, girl, I thought you could use a slushie since you're obviously so hot. Let's get our karaoke on. This one's called Love to You. Love to love you, baby. And I think you know who I'm sending this one out to. <laughs> <laughs> I've been updating it too. Isn't it? Yeah, it's August. Yeah, he has been updating it. That's amazing. Okay, let's go see River's room. And in this hallway, you can also see like my suitcases. And I just put dirty clothes like right there. I usually have a hamper, but I have no idea where it went. Are you in class? Yeah. Okay, River's in class, but this is her room. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Okay, so last but not least, I am going to show y'all the backyard. So we're heading down the stairs. I know the camera's probably so shaky right now, but this is our backyard. Going out there right now. Uh, this is the door to the backyard. I don't know why I'm narrating everything. A little garden. Chicken poop everywhere. Our chickens poop like crazy. That is basil. I think I see leaf in there. My bunny, yeah, there's leaf hiding out. He's just hanging out outside today. Hi, Leaf. 
Hi, baby. He's chilling. Straight up chilling. Let's see if he'll let me pet him. There we go. So sweet, baby. Where are they? Yeah, they like to hide out under here. The black one is named Patricia, and the gray one is Oreo. <laughs> and then we just have like some little plants and areas for them to play. A little sand pit. And this is our pool. We're working on cleaning it because it just keeps getting green. Like the water isn't murky, the bottom's just green. There's just so much algae. And that is our chicken coop. Sometimes the bunny hangs out in there too. Bunny has a cage though. But this is our chicken coop Sam built. And it's amazing. I'll show you all the inside, it's so cool. Um, there's a little lock right there. He built this from scratch. And then there's a little ladder, blanket, some hideouts, and some food. And then we just leave food and water all over the backyard for them. Like there's a food thing. Um, I don't know where the water thing is right now, but these are Slate's grow pets. That is our grill. And yeah. Okay, so that is gonna be it for this video. I hop, I hop, I hope y'all enjoyed this. I hope y'all enjoyed this little house tour. Um, make sure you like this video and subscribe to my channel. I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday most of the time. Sometimes I miss some days, sometimes I post late. You never know, so turn on the notification bell so you know when I post. Um, I will see y'all in the next video. Bye, guys. Bye.